publisher example, you've now wrapped up your design phase and you're looking to build out tools and the base platform upon which the content development team can actually then create the digital curriculum. And by that I mean you might design common themes for your activities in Smart Notebooks. Smart Notebook allows you to create templates or what we call themes so that each uh, page of your activity as, as the teacher flows through it with the learners, each page looks similar. It might have similar aspects to it, both color, placement of fonts, uh, structure of each page. Uh, you might build tools and processes for uh, embedded instructor notes for each of the lesson activities that you're developing. And there's a lot of uh, lesson activity toolkit components that are already pre-built for you to use royalty-free in, in creating these um, instructor notes for your uh, digital content. Now during the design phase you might have boiled down a set of common manipulatives that you wish to use throughout your digital curriculum uh, design and therefore in this phase you might be building these common manipulatives in either Adobe Flash and then embedding them in a uh, gallery file within Smart Notebook or you might be building these uh, common components uh, directly within Smart Notebook. Uh, again you could do this without uh, paying any royalties to Smart. All this can be distributed in the future in notebook files without any encumbrances from a business perspective. What you might also do uh, in the build-out phase, in the tools build-out phase, is design formative assessment modules directly into the, each activity that utilize smart response clickers or smart response CE which is the software only version uh, in the case of one-to-one uh, -one implementations, uh, computer labs or even um, one-to-two or one-to-three ratio classrooms where you might have uh, different computers for groups of students within the classroom. Uh, you could design a integrated experience where the teacher can go from whole class teaching to group activities and group, te gr group teaching then to a formative assessment module to ensure that children have uh, gained a uh, appropriate level of understanding of, of a subject before moving to the next next module in your digital curriculum uh, system. So now that the content publisher has built these, this base level of tools and themes and a common way to to build formative assessment modules within the uh, lesson activities, the content development team or the subject matter experts can build activities from the base this, this base platform you've developed. The content development team can also drag and drop manipulatives from either your your own set of flash objects or pull from the lesson activity toolkit and customize the manipulatives that are put into the lesson activities. The formative assessment questions can be written and tested with the products that you purchased uh, at a discount after joining the uh, Smart Ready program. And again, all this is uh, royalty free when you're distributing the notebook files. Now, it should be mentioned at this stage, there are two uh, collections of uh, digital content that come with Smart Notebook, the gallery and the lesson activity toolkit. There are two separate collections you'll see in Smart Notebook. The gallery uh, should not be used for creating for-profit digital content by uh, content publishers. It is intended more for uh, nonprofits and education educational institutions to use uh, for the purpose of creating their own uh, activities. Now the lesson activity toolkit on the other hand contains again many many uh, manipulatives created by smart technologies and that is of course royalty free to be used by content publishers when building their uh, digital curriculum. Now to complete this example of the content publisher building grade 4 math activity packs during the go-to-market phase you would confirm uh, or stay with the Smart Ready program you've, you've already joined or you could opt to move to a select level uh, because you've developed in Smart Notebook. Uh, you might certify your activities uh, online and again you can do that by going to www.smarttech.com SAP. If you scroll to the bottom of that page you will see uh, the ability to certify your software applications or your, uh, your activities you've created in Smart Notebook at a select level. This allows you to, to obtain smart logos, these select, ready, or enabled logos to be used on your marketing uh, collateral, on your product packaging, 
or even uh, directly on these, for example, splash screen you, that you might show for your software application. And if appropriate and both parties agree, uh, Smart and the ecosystem member can issue press releases around key trade shows or key events to really tell the world about this breakthrough experience of the digital content, for example, working with uh, smart hardware and software products in a customer environment. And lastly, during the distribution phase, you license your notebook activities royalty-free. This does not include the smart notebook binaries. Again, this is the uh, resulting content file with a dot notebook extension that can be distributed by the content uh, developer royalty-free. Uh, you could distribute it on uh, DVD, using the web, uh, on learning platforms, through Amazon, whatever distribution mechanism you wish to distribute the notebook file itself, then uh, you can do that royalty free. So in summary, this is a fast, low effort way to engage with SMART through our ecosystem programs and obtain significant value, whether you're a hardware company, software applications company, digital content, development company, textbook publisher, uh, really the key elements of this program allow you to associate your brand with a, a global leader in the interactive whiteboard space and indeed the interactive technologies market and drive significant new revenue for your company. The key contact points to engage with Smart's ecosystem group is ecosystem at smarttech.com. This is our general catch-all interface. However, if you have a very specific question regarding integration with our software development kit, you would email sdn at smarttech.com. That's a smart developer network. If you already know which specific program element you wish to join, or perhaps you have marketing or business questions regarding the smart accreditation program, email sap at smarttech.com. Thank you very much, and this concludes our podcast.